Welcome to the arcade, everybody. We're back in Ram Simulator. Twice in one week. Um, normally it's Sea of Thieves. Fortunately, Star was not able to get off work in time. So, yeah. Um, a lot's been going on. We got goats. Not sure if we had goats in the last episode or not. I know we were pretty close to getting them. We got goats. We got the goat cheese done. So we're now making goat cheese. I need to stop and get more packets. Uh, the sausage racks are empty. The reason being is the pigs need to go away because I need to remodify this whole area. Um, this was very poor planning. I should have had a mating pen so we can control the breeding a little bit. That's my fault. So, Seagull is going to come in here later. Not sure what time he's going to be make it, but he's going to come in here later and we are going to redo this entire area. He is going to relocate pigs for me and hello. take care of that. Well, hello, Seagull. I was just talking about you. Ah, yes. I was just telling everybody how you're going to relocate the pigs for me. Yes. Let and me just pause me... my download. It's not complete. <laughs> How much more do you have 78 to go? Um, Holy cow. It didn't go as near as I thought. It's been going since 11 to 3 hours. Wow. Let that be a lesson to everybody. Don't get the internet from the UK. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, Seagull has an opportunity to get one gig high speed, and it sounds like he's going to, so that'll be good. Uh, not till next year. Oh, not till next year. Well, I mean, that's only a couple months away. Alright, so while he's relocating pigs, I'm going to go ahead and finish up the greenhouse. Now, I know the greenhouse was in the planning stages last time that we recorded. It is now completely finished. I've got plots in... So, yeah, we're going to get this automated. I'm going to go buy watering systems. Uh, I also have a new addition to the ranch, the pickup truck. Um, makes life a lot easier, <laughs> to be honest. I should have bought this a lot earlier. Yep. In fact, Seagull, if you want to go get another vehicle, you can. That's up to you. Believe me. Hey, Believe me, I've got the money. <laughs> oh, damn, you do. Oh, yeah, these pigs. <laughs> I have not been making sausage out of the pigs. I've just been selling them one by one. And, yeah, they're making me a fortune. Without so are we keeping sausage. any or are they all going? All of them are gone. We're they will be moved to another farm. Yeah, we're going to relocate all of them. The uh, ones that, if you if you feel like making sausage, go ahead. If not, don't worry about it. Um, the ones that are good way, yeah, good luck getting in there. <laughs> Get in oh, there. No. You got a little one. Oh, you got a runner. You got two runners. All right, I'm going to let Seagull take care of the pigs. I am going to go finish the greenhouse, so we're going to run up to the store. Um, what I've been finding with the bigger ones that are of weight, use the coolers in that truck and I've just been transferring from vehicle to vehicle. That's why I said if you want to get another vehicle. Alright, okay. Saves a lot of time than putting the cooler on the ground. Okie dokie. If you notice, you have a lot of tools to do your job. Yep. L look, look at the count. <laughs> when, when you go to reload, look at the count. 
Yes. Made sure you had plenty of tools to do the job. So, all those ones in the back of the truck are already full up, yeah? Nope, they're empty. They're all empty, so okay. That's why I said if you want to go get another truck, you can. So you can just transfer them from one to the other like I was doing. I was using the side-by-side -side in the pickup truck, but uh, I need the side-by-side. -side. Oh, shoot. I found another box of ammo. I mean, another box of, uh, yeah, ammo. Oh. <laughs> Another box of tools on the ground. <laughs> Where is the um, vehicle shop? Uh, right at the bottom of our driveway. Oh, all right, okay, it's that building. Yep. Yep. You'll see a co uh, door on the corner. Just go right in that door. Walk up to the computer, and it'll show you all the vehicles available. Pick whichever one you like. Okie dokie. I can only buy 10 sprinklers at a time, really? Why is that? I don't know. It didn't let me go any higher. I was able to buy another 6 after I bought the original 10, but... Hello, Mr. Dealership man, what have you got today? Now, do the sprinklers fit in the uh, coolers or no? Um, I doubt just, it. Or is it just the seed packets? Yeah, I don't think the sprinklers will. Uh, we're going to try it. Nope. Well, that's a bummer. That means I gotta put them in the back here one by one. <laughs> <laughs> I've got 16 of these things to put in. Don't know if I'm gonna buy any seeds this time around yet or not. Might put the sprinklers in first and then. I don't know, maybe. You're, you're going to be at that uh, pig relocation for a long time. Yeah. I can't tell you how much time I already have into it, and it doesn't even look like I moved any of the pigs. <laughs> I must have moved, I don't know, probably close to 40 pigs so far, and it doesn't even look like I moved one. Typical. I was not wasting time doing, uh, sausage with them, with the no. ones that, with the ones that were weight. Nope, I don't blame you. Um, as far as the mess goes with their poop and stuff, leave it because I am going to get a composter. Okay. Although apparently that, oh no, there it is. Thought maybe that was in the other shop.
Alright, grab you. I am so glad these seeds go into coolers. Makes life so much easier. Ah, uh, must be getting ready to rain again. It's only noon and uh it's getting dark. <laughs> <laughs> Another thing I wanna do today is I wanna play with vehicle customization. I bought that truck, I wanna see what I can do with it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Now I have noticed cooler wise that pickup truck holds the same amount as the uh, side by side. Okay. Because the pickup actually, even though it's got a longer bed, you lose space because of the wheel wells. Uh, target practicing. <laughs> it, it, it's how we get the pigs to move faster. Yeah, just having a cup of tea and doing some clay pigeon shooting at the same time. He takes a lot of breaks. Oh, very nice pajamas, Lily. She's saying, and I hope it's not coming across stream too much. Because <laughs> we're just relocating them, you know, mm. taking them to auction or something. <laughs> They're all going to a good home. They are. Except for the ones that are market weight. Yeah. Sorry, it is a farm. Market weight ones become food. reaction. I thought it'd be a lot more grotesque than that. <laughs> Instead she's like, get him! <laughs> oh, you didn't buy another truck? Yeah. Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, you bought a big truck. <laughs> yeah. Well, 
Well, if you need to go buy more coolers, you can. Or let me know how many more you want. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's very true. Uh, of course, I don't know. Oh, yeah, I guess we can resell them, can't we? Um, what, the coolers? Yeah. I'm I guess sure. you should be able to. I'm not sure if I can or not. I might have to take one up to the store just to find out. Because right now I have a ton of coolers. Yeah, they always come in handy for stuff though. That is true, especially once we redo the things. Oh, you poor goats. Is he scaring you? <laughs> Every time you shoot, the goats start running. Alright. Okay. Oh, you know what I didn't do? I gotta go back up to the store. I didn't grab any of, like, the sprays or anything. Alright, yes. Phase 2 is underway. Oh, that's quite cool. You can reach all the way down the end of the truck from the actual be um, back doors. Oh, nice! So you don't even have to climb in to place them. Yeah, I wasn't sure if you'd be able to or not. I thought I might have to jump in and out, but no, I don't have to. Nice. I'm not going to buy any fertilizer, because it'll still grow even without the fertilizer. But we yep. are going to buy some agricultural medicine. And the compost works as fertilizer. Yes, which is why I got a composter. I want to see what kind of customizations I can do to this thing, so I think that's what I'm going to do next. And then, uh, once you're done relocating the pigs, that entire barn's going to be torn down. All right, yeah. We're going to set the pigs up in pens just like the goats. Yeah. But we're going to have three pens for the pigs. One for males, one for females, and one for breeding, and they're all going to be connected. Ah, uh, okay, yeah. So we're going to have, like, walkways in between them. Shoot, I want to stop to check customization. Oops. Oh, the other thing I wanted to do was, while I'm in here, hold up. While it's daylight. I need to do this. Because I wasn't able to see at night to do it. Be good if they did um, bigger storage boxes as well. <clears throat> I like know, you could right? buy industrial size ones or something.
I don't think they do any bigger ones than the actual cool boxes, do they? No, they do not. I'm not sure if I have enough metal to do these or not. Mm, wait. I might have to run to the hardware shop too. There we go, now I can work. Now I can work in the greenhouse at night. Just put some lighting in it. Oh, you put your lights in there? Yeah, I was trying to work in there the other day at night, and you just couldn't see anything. I figure the greenhouses at night is about the only time I'm going to be able to actually do anything with them. Yeah. I don't know if that's enough lighting. I might have to put some more lights in here. I guess we'll see tonight when it's actually dark. We're not going to worry about working at night right now. Okay. <clears throat> that way you can keep re relocating those pigs during the daylight hours. Alright, oh, yeah, it's easier, isn't it? Yes, the auctions open during daylight hours for you to sell them. Ah, oh, yes. Let's see here. There's no extras for this car, really? Okay, well, that was kind of a bummer. Alright, let's go put the gas in this side by side, and then I'm going to take my pickup truck. Any extras on the pickup truck? Oh, did you check the fuel in that big truck when you bought it? Uh, no. Because I noticed no, that when I, I when I bought my pickup truck, the uh, bastards only gave me half a tank. That's a bit rude. I know, right? So first thing I had to do after running up to the store and doing uh, two loads of pig relocation, I'm like, I gotta go get gas. Very well. Uh, I think I'm going to run out of boxes before I run out of gas. Yeah, probably. I figured it'll take a couple loads. You haven't seen how many I can fit in. In other words, let's go ahead and take one and up and see if we can uh, sell it because if we can we're gonna okay so all the baby pigs are being dropped off at the orphanage now so it's just the uh, adult pigs that we need to sort okay and it's up to you if you want to make them in the sausage or yeah sausage or not I very much doubt that. <laughs> you see how many there are? <laughs> I know, it's... Uh, trust me, I know. I've already relocated, like I said, about 40 of them. Maybe even more. Yep. 
and it didn't even look like I put a dent in them. I had to use seven boxes, just uh, seven of the removing crates, just to uh, get the youngsters to orphanage. Yeah, that doesn't surprise me any. Because I want to see if I can sell you. Are there any more storage boxes in here? No. Have you got any more storage boxes laying around, or is it just the ones that were in there? That would be it. Right, okay. That's what I want to... I want to take that storage box, or the uh, cooler up. To see if I can sell it back. Because if I can, then we'll just buy a whole bunch of them, you know what I mean? Yeah. You want me to do it? Because I can fit a ton of them in the back of this. Um, sure, if you'd like. There's an empty one. Because you'll only get a couple in your wagon, won't you? Yeah, there's an empty one sitting in the back of the uh, side by side if you want to take that one up and see if you can return it. Oh, I think I'm probably about to have a couple of empties. Oh, yeah, you think you will, <laughs> won't you? Cabbage. That means one of the other ones is missing one. Uh, looks like I've only got one. No, oh, no, I got two pineapple. Hmm. No, I don't think. Hang on, sell. Yeah, you can sell them. Okay. Then you get twenty dollars back. Well, that's okay. Buy as many as you'd like. <laughs> that probably do. Oh, I forgot they do that. <laughs> What's that? Oh, yeah, all over the place. Yeah. Paddock's storage box central up here. But of course, to chuck them in here, they can just go anywhere. Yup.
Alright, greenhouse is now full of food. Oh. So since all the rest of them are market weight, I can pretty much start helping you now. Uh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> I just looked at Discord. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Shoot, actually, I gotta milk these goats. Because it's soon time for us to get some sleep. I can't believe they don't have a packing function where you just put up in the bay, order what you want, and they just put it in the pack for you. I know, right? That'd be too easy. Okay, so the lighting in here is sufficient. It's more like mood lighting. Which is... <laughs> which, I mean, that's not that bad. I can see all... Everything I need to see. actually not bad at all. I can live with that. Alright, whenever you're back and ready to sleep. Almost. Two more boxes. Just about see the last box. <laughs> Use your light. Oh, or your yeah. or your torch as you call it. What about that? Oh well, it's loaded now. Oh, okay. Oh hello. All the caravans seem to have got stuck. Get out of the way. Again? Yeah. <laughs> when, when I first drove the pickup truck, I did not realize how bad the turning is on it. I was so used to the snappy turning of the, uh... Of yeah, course. this year is that problem. Yeah, I was so used to the snappy turning of the side-by-side. So going to the pickup truck where it actually turns like a truck, I was hitting everything. <laughs> <laughs> I was running into trees and other vehicles. Oh yes, of course, we're going to be sleeping in water again. Like being back in sunken land. I know, right? And no, at least in sunken land when we sleep, we're on a dry platform. Right. I have voted to sleep. I have as well. And we're gonna wake up in a puddle, and we did. <laughs> Ta-da! Boxes! Holy boxes! Alright, let me check out the plants. Water's good, drone's good. 
I don't see any of them with an issue. I mean, I don't know what this stuff does. Disease control. So I don't know if I have to use it when they're... I don't know if it's going to tell me if they've got a disease or if I should just use it automatically. Uh, I don't know. I don't know either. I'm just going to kind of let it ride and see what happens for this first one. Alright, let's go ahead and take the pickup truck down and see what customization I can do to this thing, if any. I like how my truck came free dirty. Yeah. It did, I pulled it out and it was completely filthy. It's like, really? Don't even bother cleaning it for me? I mean, I know I'm gonna get it filthy, but damn. They could have at least sold you it clean. everything but the rack in the back. Oh, actually, that's not too bad. Alright. Now, question. How do I use... Is there a button? What do you mean I can't put anything in it? How's it got stuff in it already? Who? Huh? Now oh, don't tell me it didn't empty out all my boxes. That one's already got meat in it, apparently. Well, that one's already got... If you don't have the boxes directly over the cell point, it won't take it. So it seems. Yeah, you gotta make sure they're all in the yellow zone. Have you seen the size of this truck? I have... Which means, in order for it to work... Probably have to go backwards and forwards a couple of times. Yeah, you might have to do it in two sections. The easy way of testing that is know how many boxes are in there, times it by 12, and that's how many should sell. Yep. All right, let's help him out. So do you know how many boxes you have? Um, I bought 30. And in there at the moment, there is one, two, three, six, ten. So 
that's 12 in there, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 22, 22, Looks like you've got 42 total. Okie dokie. So that should be 420, 462, 464, 504. You've got meat everywhere. I just picked a piece of meat out of the window. <laughs> <laughs> well, some of them didn't sit still. <laughs> <laughs> that is hilarious. I better start clearing this pile in the corner, I suppose. Be where you find a live one underneath them all. <laughs> I know, right? Oh, actually, I am going to be back. There's one thing I wanted to check out. I noticed a sign earlier. Oh, right. For an auction. Oh. I want to see what it was about. Yeah. Oh, shoot. That was a tree. You know, since we're taking all these pigs to auction. You can buy horses. Oh, really? Yes. So you can strap the dead pig on the horse and just take it over. Yes, you buy horses at the auction. Okay. okay. So now the question is, do we keep the barn? What, this one? Yeah and put, uh, make it a stable. Can you use it for the same thing? You don't have to modify it. Oh, uh, we could put, um, stables in there. All right, okay. Just need to give it a wash. Yeah. That means we're going to need another area for the pigs. Hmm. Where are we going to move the pigs to? Supermarket? The... <laughs> Supermarket. No, I mean the new batch of pigs that we're going to get. Because we're, oh, gonna... okay. we're still going to do pigs. I still like my sausage. Sausage is still a viable means. I guess maybe over here, but hmm. All right, let's finish clearing out these pigs, and then we'll figure it out, right? Yep. Oh, that's this one's already got uh, pig meat in it. Yeah, as I was saying, some of them obviously didn't actually uh, go in the trigger point last time.
so much, so many pigs, oh my gosh. How did it get this out of hand? <laughs> <laughs> it didn't take long to get this out of hand either. That's the funniest part. Uh, I guess if you got a couple of females in there, it don't take long. That's why breeding pen is essential. Yep. For the next round. Whoops. Helps if I grab a cooler. Uh, it's almost all of them in here. Yep. There's a few in the front garden, though. Yeah, I think when we change this over to horses, um, I'm going to redo that front fencing. Yeah. I'm hoping horse breeding is not a thing because I'd like to keep most of the horses <laughs> pastured, you know? Yeah. All oh, right. Yeah. That's all the boxes. Uh, I do have two more if you want them. Uh, that's right. I'll take these. Okay. Might as well oh, keep the other two for vegetarians. Um, I wonder if I can put these all in a cooler. No, I cannot. Okay. The vegetables do not go in a cooler. Vegetables are huge. Okay, so should be five hundred and four chunks of meat. So let's see how this works. So some of the vegetables will go in cores. Let's take all of them. Let's have a look. Five hundred and four items. It does do it all in one go if you get it in the right place. Oh, nice.
be in my truck. <laughs> <laughs> Really, I got a cargo rack up there that I can't use? <laughs> You're kidding. What, the rack on top of the vehicle? Yeah, I can't use it. <laughs> Seems a bit dull. I know, right? Alright, bell peppers are just gonna have to sit and wait. What? I'm gonna end up having to keep that truck. <laughs> the one that you bought. Yeah. Because these vegetables are huge. Did you see the size of these watermelons? No. Oh, they're huge. Can you put them inside a cooler box, eh? Nope. Oh, damn. You can't do the heads of lettuce either, and they're as big as basketballs. <laughs> Alright, now the question of the day. Does the burger joint take veggies? Hmm, you'd think so. They do. They don't pay very much, though. Well, that's it. I made 48 bucks. <laughs> Hardly seems worth it. <laughs> hmm. And that's uh, what you can do with them. I don't think there's anything that I can do with them. Alright, so now I see why some people have said that uh, they started a greenhouse and then they gave up on the greenhouse. It ain't very productive. Productive, yes. Um, beneficial, no. Space in the container. It does seem like a lot of these vegetables, though, don't have to replant. Uh, okay. Just gonna kind of let them go and see what happens.
So the peppers are worth it. I made forty eight bucks. You sell them in the same place. Yeah, I made them I made forty eight bucks on the peppers alone. The lettuce and the watermelon are not worth it. And the peppers fit inside the cooler. Yeah, I'm selling them all to the burger joint. They decided they want to uh, add a vegan menu. <laughs> I mean, technically, these are vegetarian pigs. They only eat grass and grain. I know, right? So, you could argue that it's okay to eat them. i seen a meme about that. I keep pigs because they, uh... They're vegan, and they turn uh, vegetables into bacon. <laughs> How many vegetables can you fit in a storage box? Um, with the bell peppers, I can fit 12. Oh, right, okay. So clearly physics weren't a thing when doing this then. Nope, they just do 12. <laughs> That's what can you fit in a storage box? Well, you can fit 12 peppers or a family of pigs. I mean, <laughs> you think of it like that. <laughs> I don't know, most of these you can only fit you part of a pig in a box. Well, yeah. Well, I do know from uh, my ranch that you could fit 12 babies in one box. <laughs> <laughs> More ethical. <laughs> I'm a little more ethical, yes. Rather than slaughtering a whole barn full of pigs. It's almost pig free. Yep. Do you want all these empty storage boxes put? Um, you can sell them back. Just gonna sell them back. Yeah, in fact, there's like no poop in here now. I lost all my poop. Yeah. Like, seriously, there's none. It's like, that don't make much sense. It's like the poop goes away as you get rid of the pig, maybe? It doesn't really make an awful lot of sense. No, not really. Alright, so I'm gonna keep these horses.
think just three horses. I mean, I don't want to go all out and get too many horses. No, you don't need too many, do you? No. Because you're just buying them for pleasure, aren't you? Not. Yeah, these not are just make horse burgers. No, I'm hoping that the horses do not have breeding mechanics. So you want all these boxes sold, yeah? Yep. I don't think we need them. I mean, how, well, we've got to keep at least, what, 12 of them or something like that? Huh? For when, oh, you we, want 12. Do, on, on for when we start doing pigs again. Because remember, we need enough boxes to make sausage. Five. Six. We are not done with the pigs. Yeah. We are just... Nine. Doing some relocation stuff. Eighteen. Eleven. We are just there changing is twelve. Some, we're just changing some things around. Unless of course we just want to go goats. I mean Hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> Make sure none of them got any pork in them. <laughs> Ah, uh, look at you, you're coming right to Yep, me. they're all empty. Not bad, it only took a day and a half. I know, right? Shoot, I forgot to get more of that. Tomorrow I need to go get metal. We will just take the big truck. That big truck I have a feeling is going to get more use than uh, I originally thought it would. <laughs> well, I thought you'd fit a lot more in it, you see. You do fit a lot more in it. And it's empty. And we're at forty two thousand dollars. <laughs> We gotta start planning out these next set of pens. So, how big are you planning on doing them? Um, I'm thinking probably about the size of the goat pens. Yeah. 
three by five, three by four, something like that. I mean, it's definitely going to be monitored a lot better than last time because of having a breeding pen. Ah, actual proper stables. Yes. So I said how many horses? Three? Yeah, I should think so. Yeah, there. so there we go. We have room for three. I don't know, actually having a... These two produce a lot of milk. <laughs> I'm serious, like every... Look, go in and look how much... How did Daddy Goat around. leave? I did not put a Daddy Goat in there. Ah, okay. I am only buying Mama Goats. Ah, I see. No, oh, yeah, so there's quite a lot of cheese in there. <laughs> yeah, that's every two to, two to three days. So, what do you think? Think we should put the goat or the uh, new pig pens like out here? Yeah, there's plenty of space. Because we want to leave a gap for us to be able to get to the fields with the tractors if we ever decide to. do that. No matter where you put them, you're going to need another grain thing, aren't you? It's not going to fit in the same area. Yeah, we're going to need another grain thing. We're also going to need another uh, water thing. Which is, I mean, we got $42,000. Yeah. We're not hurting for money right now. <laughs> so yeah, that's what I'm thinking out here. We'll see in the daylight, though. Yeah, I'm thinking maybe started like here. Yep. Go three towards the front. Uh, I don't know. And then five long. Yeah. I'm looking at where the ranch begins though. So maybe start here. And then we're going to do three pens across. Yep. And we want them connected with one single. That way we can transfer them in and out. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Alright, you want to start on that and I will make a run up to the uh, hardware store or do you want to make a run to the hardware store and I'll start the planning of this? Um, I'll go to the shop if you want, and you can plan exactly where you want it to go. Alright. Um, what we need at the shop is a bunch of wood and a bunch of metal. Okie dokie. I haven't been sawing any wood lately. I've just been buying it straight from the shop. Yeah, it's not like you can't. Uh, I think you've already bought a load of stuff. Oh, there's probably a load of stuff already there, yeah. There's one, two, three, 
11, 9, 11, 15, 15, 17, 19, 20. About 25 piles of planks. Yeah, it sounds about right. Hate when you lose count. You can do it that way. Doesn't look right, but that said 18, so. Right, let's have a look. Metal, did you say? Yeah, we're gonna need a shit ton of metal. Um, it's 150 just for. The windmill, I don't remember how much it is for the, uh. Silo, and I need ten metal per for the horses, so that's thirty just right there for the horses.
I think it's not for up here. doesn't snap for down here. Oh, nope, did not snap. Hold on. It's so gonna snap here, but it won't snap back there. Alright. We can make this work. I do not have the gates in yet. Okay, so I do want to build faster horse stables. Sure. Although you've already done the wood for those of you, it's just metal. Yes. Okay, that's those done. Do you want the wood put in here yet? Are you happy with where they are or might they need moving? No, they're not going to need moving. I just need to put the uh, gates in yet. So should I start doing the sides? Yeah, I'm getting ready to do the gates right now. Really, I hate when it does that. No putting gates at the back, are you? No. no. I actually have to go back and get some more wood. Yeah, this is going to take a lot of wood. It is not a small project.
And there we go. That's it built. Now the question is, will the grains um hmm. Oh yeah, covers all three pens, sweet. Without an issue. We can put feeding troughs pretty much in any anywhere in these pens. Uh, that's good then. Except it's clipping through back there. So we gotta move it out just a hair. Beautiful. What do you think? It looks good. Damn, these horse stalls look nice, don't they? They do, didn't they, actually? I didn't expect them to look this good. Gotta tear this fence down. <laughs> And redo it. Through it all, we still have thirty-five thousand dollars. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, we need a concrete for this. I forgot about that. And so I'll go back down to get some more wood in a minute, anyway. We can store the metal upstairs in the uh, shed. Since we don't really have a use for the upstairs right now. Not the end of time yet, it's only a pass free. They're hungry. <laughs> There's a cupboard full of biscuits and crisps and stuff they can help themselves to for now. <laughs> yeah, I guess we figured out a use for the loft up here. Storage. Yeah, storage. Shame it hasn't got a way of just chucking it up through the window. I know, right?
How much more would we need? Roughly, probably another what? Ten stacks. Uh, probably. So go like twenty. Okie dokie. We can always use wood. And how much concrete? Um, let's see here. It needs fifty concrete. Concrete's not right, something we okay. use very often. Okay. So I would just get what we need for that. Yep. It's quite a new pot, isn't it? Smells right, give it a stir. Get a knife and give it a stir, probably be alright. It's just gone watery, because of the peanut oil. And how much concrete did you say? 50. 50 kilograms? Yeah. Maybe I should have kept a couple more of these coolers. <laughs> bit late now. Yeah, a bit late now. There's tomatoes. Tomatoes and peppers, let's see if they're worth it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to make it to the sale in time, though. What time's it shut? I don't know. I know the peppers are worth it. Lettuce and watermelon are not worth it. No. No. So we're about to see if tomatoes are worth it. Tomatoes and peppers are worth it. They are. Oh, tomatoes are definitely worth it, man. They're six bucks a piece. And you get quite a few of them. Tomatoes might be more worth it than the bell peppers.
got a pineapple. Pumpkins. do I have here? Another pineapple. I'm trying to fit as much as I can in the back of this truck. Is My little watermelons. I mean, I guess in the end it's all worth it. Well, yeah, because you bought everything now, and you say. Yeah. So it's all pretty much profit. Strawberries that are done. More watermelons. Else it's done. Yep, more pineapples. Big pens are done. Nice. Right, anything else ready? Yeah, yeah, they are quite big, aren't they? They are. Alright, let's go ahead and sell this load. See if I can get these coolers in here. Alright, that should be everything. I shall stick the remaining wood planks inside that little holder thing. Okay. Tomorrow I think we'll get a male and a female pig. And get them started. Start our new and improved breeding. <laughs> See, all together, I mean, it's 232 bucks, which isn't great, but it's not. It's something. Yeah. It's more than the seed cost. A lot more than the seed cost, yes. Is it something that you could make a fortune off of? Hell no. <laughs> And let's hit it on a huge scale. Yeah. Oh, 
Oh shoot, we got all that cheese that's gotta come out of there. Ah, uh, yes. Eventually, we're going to do three more pens like that for cows. Yep. And then we'll have every animal in the game, right? Uh, uh yeah. Goats, cows, pigs, horses. That didn't sound very good. Ah, it's just a fence. Especially since, uh, actually this milking should, uh, <laughs> fill up the... Oh, they're ready to be milked. They're over here waiting. They were both over here waiting. Like, come on, milk us. <laughs> So that, oh shoot, I can't be turned into cheese. I don't have any more mold. That's not a good thing. There's cheese selling at 115 a pop, you know. <laughs> now what did you run into? Right. Well, I thought if I make it look like a pig, um, when you kill the pigs and they're going in the back, they're like, oh, we're just going in the big pig. You see? <laughs> you make them feel better about the whole thing. All right. Um, we're going to call it an episode here. <laughs> we're we're going to end it with the pink truck. The giant pig. The giant pig. So I want to thank everybody for watching today. Oh, I want to thank everybody who supports the channel. If you haven't already, hit that follow button. It means more to us than you'll ever know. And yeah, we'll see you all in the next one. Have a great day, everybody.